All right, I'm Dave, Dave Haynes, and I do front of house for Black Eyed Peas. This is the Digidesign venue. This physical one was actually a gift to the Peas, I believe five years ago, um, from Digidesign, because the Peas have always had a really good relationship with, um, with Pro Tools and with Digidesign, and uh, so they gave this to them for touring and uh, gave them an icon for the studio. This is just a quick rundown of what I do out here during the show. Um, we've got um, about 10 channels of digital drums, uh, three channels of cymbals, hi-hats, real snare, and three real toms. So the drums are in three, three layers across the left side here. The three sets of stereo keys, not counting an offstage piano that's used later, and a vocoder. Then you've got uh, six channels of playback, and also an MPC. This com playback's coming from digital performer on the side of the stage for a lot of the auxiliary tracks, all the strings and things like that where we don't have room for on stage in ADP string section. We've got a synth guitar, three channels of electric guitars, two channels of acoustic guitars, two different sets of DJ lines for different points in the show, three different headset mics, one for Will, one for Taboo, one for Fergie. I've also got two channels of auto-tune returning that are used on different songs for Will and Fergie mostly that are being fed both from the handhelds and from the headsets at different points. You got your 75 inputs over here flowing into the eight VCAs over here. For sure the biggest issue that I've run into on this run and this tour, because we've now got the thrust coming out in front of the PA and we've got people on headset mics and they want more volume for this show than ever before because they want, the, they want it to sound like a club in here. And a lot of these arenas uh, leave, leave something to be desired acoustically. You've got everything possible that is not uh, feedback friendly <laughs> in that environment. So I'm, I'm, I'm supposed to push the music as loud as, you know, as loud as a club and then put vocals on top of that in front of the PA with headsets, with effects, with auto-tune, all these different things. And then also, you know, try to incorporate the acoustics in here. You know, first of all, to get all that, the level, just that is a challenge in itself. And then try to make it sound tasteful and artful, that's a challenge as well. Those are all independently challenging things. You mix them all together and it becomes a new kind of mess. But, you know, that's what makes you better. That's, what, uh, that's how you get to the next level, having all these things thrown at you at once. <laughs>